so uh, something that I've been realizing again of late chatting to some friends and some peeps is you know this thing that dives up in our lives sometimes we just can't help it is what we normally say and that is stresses and worries about what's busy happening about what is to happen what needs to happen you know all of a sudden something happens in your whole life flips upside down you feel at times staying in a place you need to get out something accidentally happens at work and you might be short of work because of this incident as examples and you know we, we we pray we ask you know god help me out help me out you know when you give it completely over you know we learn we must be learning all the time and we do learn we get told you know praise him in the storm and until he opens the door you praise him in the hallway and that's how we should roll but every time we worry again and we stress again we actually kind of are taking that thing back out of his hands and God's a gentleman you know he stands back and he and he and he, and he waits for you to give it back to him so he can do what he needs to do something that's popped up in my life tremendously over just the last week um, about I would say is Isaiah 60 22 when, where, where God says when the time is right I the Lord will make it happen not me not me I won't make it happen God will make it happen when the time is right and you know sometimes he waits a little bit longer I feel that's how I feel he does in my life you know he waits a little bit longer he almost waits to the edge where there's no time left for whatever it is that needs to happen to happen whether it's, it's money that needs to be paid for something and he waits to the nip you know on the, on the nipperky man just to test to see how strong your faith is in him and he's come through every single time for me. And I find myself currently in positions where I get to see how he's coming through for close friends of mine in the same scenarios. Where he's just coming through and he's doing exactly what he said he would do. The Bible says God is good. Where I can see he's being good to not only me but to those people. Where he steps in, where he says, I, the Lord, will make it happen. And I see it happening. And it happens. And to hear the joy of those people's voices when they share these these testimonies of theirs and yet still you know two days later or a day later or a moment later something else is different and it's and it's a similar incident you know and they go, and, and I'm, I'm the guy that goes hey hey remember remember and i've actually asked one of my peeps i go listen do you have a, a, a you got me stuck on a recording somewhere and just hit play every now and then to remind yourself about because i feel like a stuck recorder sometimes and even i'm talking about me too i remind myself from this uh from time to time as well you know so yeah just take hold of that remember god is good he will not fail you he's never lost a battle and when the time is right he will make it happen you can believe him, he will not fail you.